Denmark, like most of Europe, had post-war immigration policies that basically invited guest workers in, and then the guest workers stayed, which they hadn't expected, and then various other things happened. Now, nobody was talking about Islam in this period. I mean, it wasn't in Britain until the Satanic Verses affair in 1989, when the fatwa was imposed on a British novelist by the Ayatollah, that we started talking about Islam in Britain, really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And in, in Denmark, it didn't happen until 2005, when one newspaper, one newspaper editor, the editor of the culture section of Jyllands Posten, discovered that in a set of children's books about the great religions, they couldn't find anyone to illustrate the one on the Islam because nobody was willing to draw pictures of Muhammad. And so this newspaper editor, the culture editor of the paper, commissioned 12 people who were prominent cartoonists in Denmark to do cartoons of Muhammad. Some of them did.